Would a trade for Baker Mayfield seem smart for Seattle? Yeah, yeah. or maybe if they want to add somebody to compete. But I mean, quite <laughs> frankly, I, I don't think Baker Mayfield. And, and I'm and I'm trying to put this a nice way because you know, Baker is a former number one overall pick. He came into the NFL as one of the more accurate quarterbacks. He can get outside and get on the move. And quite frankly, uh, he's he's had his moments but he hasn't really fulfilled what he was supposed to be. Mm. And I think there's a reason right now that no one is trading for Baker Mayfield. So, yeah, they could trade for him, not at that number of $19 million, but if, if Cleveland were to sweeten the pot, eat some of the money, yeah, I guess you could bring him out there. I personally think Baker Mayfield's best position this year is going to be as a backup quarterback somewhere. Everyone is throwing out Tampa Bay. I don't care where you put him at. I just don't think he's one of the 32 best quarterbacks in the National Football League that we can say that today. And I think if you're Seattle, you got to be intrigued by Drew Locke. You have Geno Smith there. So I just don't think that Baker is a shoe-in. Uh, let's not forget, Baker came out and said, I want to go to Indy. Indy said, nah, Baker, we don't want you. Then Carolina said, nah, we'll pass. So where exactly is Baker Mayfield going to go? I think he needs to be on the bench somewhere for a year. <laughs> bug, bug, big bro. All you had to say was no, no, no. They should not <laughs> no, I... <laughs> trade for Baker Mayfield. They should not be in the market for Baker Mayfield. <laughs> Baker Mayfield needs, like, I, I firmly believe this, bug, and I said this in all seriousness about Jameis Winston when he left Tampa and went to New Orleans. Okay. Baker Mayfield needs to go sit behind a veteran mm -hmm. and understand not only how to play on the field, but how you lead a locker room. Yeah. And how you be a guy that doesn't let the emotions get the best of you and you just go about your job. The one thing people don't say about quarterbacks and I think is a trait and Boog, you've been around great ones, that I think is a trait, all of them are methodical. Mm. They never get too high. They mm. never get too low. That is one trait between the good ones and the great ones that I think everybody can relate to. And when you see these guys going up and down like we've seen Baker do, Making this statement, talking about it won't work. I'm, 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 I'm going to tell you what my head and my heart is. Bro, nothing. Did we see how Matt Ryan handled the situation mm. when, when they were in the market for Deshaun Watson? Did we see how, they, how, yes. how Jimmy Garoppolo is handling the situation and how he handled it when his team gave away three first-round picks after he took a, went to a Super Bowl with the team? Mm. Those are the things I feel like Baker needs to benefit from. He needs to be in a quarterback room with a guy that's done it in this league, with a guy that understands how to lead in the locker room and how to go about their business day to day. I think that would pay huge dividends for Baker Mayfield. I do not believe he's a lost cause. Mm. Y'all know as hard as I am on Baker Mayfield, I do not believe he's a lost cause at playing quarterback. I think he needs a part of the Jameis Winston. And Jameis' thing was turnovers. Baker got a lot of things that he needs to fix. I think he would benefit from being around a veteran. All right, well, there we have it. I thought Booger was jumped back in there. This is the beauty on, of doing television. No, I mean, no, 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 my bad, Swag. <laughs> you, you know, I was trying to pass the baton back over to Boog, but uh, certainly a lot of no meat doubt. on the bone of that conversation. It certainly feels like <clears> the <throat> speed bump, if you will, is the $19 million salary that Baker Mayfield has for 2022. Oof. Whether a team so wants to eat part, take on part of that probably remains to be determined. So Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.